the countless lives that we're losing is just terrifying at this moment. But it's also so sad to see people trying to find and justify reasons of why these things should be happening and why it can be looked at as okay. If you followed his career from So You Think You Can Dance to The Ellen DeGeneres Show, you may have questions about how Stephen Twitch Boss died and what caused his death. Interestingly, as revealed by his wife, the reason might not be as straightforward as fans assumed at the start. But what happened? Before we continue, please give it a like and hit the subscribe button. It really helps me grow the channel so I can bring you the hottest tea every week. After more than 10 years in the entertainment industry, Twitch passed away on December 13, 2022. Born in Montgomery, Alabama, he became well-known in 2008 after finishing second on the fourth season of So You Think He Can Dance. In 2011, 2012, and 2013, he returned to the program as an all-star. In 2015, he served as team captain. Additionally, from 2014 until the talk show's end in 2022, Twitch performed as a DJ on The Ellen DeGeneres Show. On December 14, 2022, Twitch's wife, Allison Holker, revealed her husband's passing in a statement to People. Holker said in a statement, It is with the heaviest of hearts that I have to share that my husband, Stephen, has left us. Stephen lit up every room he stepped into. She continued, to say that he left a legacy would be an understatement, and his positive impact will continue to be felt. I am certain there won't be a day that goes by that we won't honor his memory. Now, let's take a look at how they met. In 2006, Twitch and Holker first came into contact at a gathering that a mutual friend was throwing. But it wasn't until the Step Up 3D premiere in August 2010 that their relationship took a romantic turn. The two became engaged in 2013 when Twitch proposed to Holker while they were filming a commercial. Later, Maddox, their son, was born in 2016. Holker told OK Magazine in October 2022 that she and her husband were still in their honeymoon phase. She said, We already spent so much time together, but now we wake up, we go to our office together, and we work together all day. I know a lot of people probably think that sounds crazy, but we love it. Law enforcement sources told TMZ that Holker hurried into a Los Angeles Police Department station on the evening of Twitch's death in a panic because Twitch had left their home without his car. He had never done this before. Twitch checked in at the Oak Tree Inn Motel in Encino, California on the morning of December 12, 2022, the day before he passed away, according to all the sources who spoke to TMZ. To prevent anyone from contacting or tracking him, he took an Uber from his house to the motel and put his phone in airplane mode. On December 13th, 2022, housekeeping knocked on Twitch's door after he failed to check out by his scheduled time of 11 a.m. and did not answer their calls. When there was no answer, management opened the door, saw a body on the floor, and immediately called the police. When paramedics responded to the call for a medical emergency there, he was discovered dead from a self-inflicted gunshot wound in the bathroom at roughly 11.15 a.m. On the spot, he was declared dead. Employees at the hotel told TMZ that when Twitch arrived, he didn't appear to be in trouble or visibly distressed. He arrived with a small backpack and only rented the hotel for one night, according to the staff members who spoke to TMZ. On the day Twitch's body was discovered, the employees confirmed that Twitch was alone and that everything was normal when he checked it. There were no indications of foul play, and investigators ruled it as a suicide. There are now more facts coming up about Stephen Twitch Boss's passing. According to reports, a suicide note was discovered next to the deceased's body. The note indicated that he couldn't go on anymore. Specifics about the content of the letter will not be given. Online theories have been running wild, and fans are trying to find the real cause of his passing. Boss mentioned previous struggles in the note he left in his hotel. Some theories have focused on his financial troubles, but according to TMZ, neither the dancers, family members, nor he himself was experiencing any at the time of his passing. What do you think is the actual reason behind Twitch Boss's sudden death? And if you like this video, click the subscribe button and hit the bell icon to be the first to see my next video. I post updates like this every week where I uncover the secrets of your favorite celebrities.